All eyes on Kylian Mbappe. A hat-trick in his last game. Can he continue that red-hot form? It's live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to delightful Las Palmas. We're here at the Estadio de Gran Canaria. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And coming up, pulsating action from La Liga EA Sports. It is Las Palmas facing Real Madrid. Thanks, Derek. Well, Real won't be overly happy with the start to their season. They just haven't looked at their best. Maybe a little rusty, maybe adjusting to different tactics. Whatever it is, they need a win here today. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, in this shape, if they're wide players, they high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated, and it could be difficult for them. Uh, based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. Well, there we have it, the first yellow card of the game. And he's going to have to be careful now. There's a long time to go here. Mbappe tries his luck. The save made following the free kick, and he was able to hang on to the ball. Federico Valverde. Nicely timed tackle. Javi Munoz. Real with the ball again. And Bellingham. It could be! He got a good palm on it. And he gobbles up the second chance. Disappointment for the keeper. No wonder he's asking questions of his defence. Well, as you can see, the first save is a good one. They can't react quickly enough to the second ball. The keeper's a bit unlucky, really. So underway again here, one nil the score. Bellingham. Shuameni. Now Eder Militao. Jude Bellingham. Rosada. Javi Munoz. Perfect challenge. Jude Bellingham. Mendy has it. Bellingham. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter, but they took care of the situation defensively. Kirian. Javi Munoz. Viti Rosada. Tejinho. 
referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. Could be threatening. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. Mbappe. Well, a pass like that has got to be spot on, and in the end it wasn't. And they will be awarded a free kick for that. Javi Munoz. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Bellingham. Shuameni. Mendy has it. Well, the scoreline means they can focus on keeping possession. Vinicius Junior and moving the ball nicely Valverde Daily Sink Grafen Javi Munoz Viti Rosada. Tidy in possession. Mbappe, and a goal it is for Real Madrid. They are on a victory course. Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place. But give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. So 2-0 now. Javi Munoz. Released it nicely. Simple catch, really. Kiria. McKenna. Now with Sink Grafen. Kiria. Intercepted it. Federico Valverde. Now with Bellingham. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. Valverde. And the decision offside here. So on the cusp of half-time and Real Madrid well on top. Stuart, interested as always to get your take. Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow Ooh. of the game, they've won their individual battles and they've created numerous chances. Their only problem in the second half could be complacency, but I can't see that happening. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick.
really well played pass. The referee has given the advantage to Real Madrid. Terrific defending to stop them progressing. Ball retention so important. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. Could play it in. And Bellingham. Now with Mbappe. Vinicius. On to Mendy. Vinicius Jr. Not capable of so much better, to be honest. Well, I expected more as well, Derek. I thought from that sort of position, he had every chance of scoring, but it's a poor effort. McKenna. It's with Nsoki. Viti Rosada. Kirian. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Mbappe into the middle. Pretty simple for the keeper. Kirian on to Sinkgraven well there it is the referee's whistle half time here at the Estadio de Gran Canaria well choose your descriptive word where Kylian Mbappe is concerned explosive is one adjective you could use Stuart well he's been at his best today he just seems to get his shots away so easily and he's taken his goals really well brilliant stuff from him And off and running again after a dizzying first-half performance by Real. Will we see more of the same in the second 45? Federico Valverde. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Rodrigo. A glorious chance. And his eyes lit up in anticipation of his third goal of the game. Well, the way he's finished today, that was a decent chance. But you just sense the hat-trick is coming. Nsoki. And playing it to the goalkeeper. Cutting off the supply. Good high press. Well, we can see what they're trying to do, but not a memorable passage of play. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. And Bellingham. A oh, strong hand on the ball. Determined defending. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. He's driven in the corner. Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. Rosada. Dejinho. Viti Rosada. Nsoki. Dejinho. Well, Chelsea have been busy in the transfer market and the contract situation has been ironed out. We could see him in action pretty soon, Stuart. 
Well, at around £50 million, I think they've probably paid the right amount for him. He's a wonderfully gifted player who, on his day, will certainly excite the fans. Dejinho. Javi Munoz. A better challenge. Oh, good vision. They could be for Mbappe. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat-trick. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And all you can do is admire the finish by Mbappe. He hits the ball so cleanly. It's a fantastic strike. in control Bailey Sinkgrafen really committed himself to the tackle and a throw in now well, we're into the final half hour another La Liga treat in store for you soon on EA TV it's Las Palmas against Alaves after the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. And they're making a change. Yanuzai on to Sink Grafen. Well timed tackle. A more exciting La Liga action coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Real Madrid against Real Betis. I like the look of that game. The atmosphere is always good inside that stadium, and two very good teams. Real Madrid have given us away. Adnan Yanuzai. McKenna. Tavernier. Strong play here. But he could give it away. The ball back with Real now. Valverde. Oh, did so well to deny him. Well, they've decided to make a change. <laughs> Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, still an issue here. Rodrigo. Well, far too much on that particular cross. Bellingham. And now Rodrigo. Jude Bellingham. Well, it's such an eye-catching series of passes. There's a cutback. And Bellingham... Many. Oh, that surely had to go in, but marvellous defending. This looks promising. McKenna. Pejinho. Determined defending. Mendy, Mbappe in the centre. 
Well, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. Now with Tavernia. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. Yeah, he's not putting his full weight on that foot at the moment because he actually got trodden on in the last challenge. Keep an eye on this one. Cheers, Jeff. Sinkrafen. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Mbappe, and he's in. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, and Mbappe just hits it with such confidence. He strikes it so cleanly. It's a great goal. a massive lead and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now Adnan Yanuzai and support available Adnan Yanuzai on to Sinkgrafen it's a neat move must be Federico Valverde ran it well Adnan Yanuzai and room now out on the wing Federico Valverde now can they counter clinically Sweeping attacking play. Well, they just couldn't finish off what would have been a great goal on the counter-attack. Soki. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Space on the flank. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Mbappe. And that is that, the end of the game. It goes into the books as a win for Real Madrid. What did you think of their overall performance? Well, they were good today. Some of their passing football was excellent, but they do need to show a bit more consistency. Can they now keep it going? That's the big question.